So here we are in Sunny's on Edinburgh. Well, I'm in Sunny's on Edinburgh. You're virtually in Sunny's on Edinburgh. And it feels so nice to be back here in the Shrine Room after 10 weeks since I've been here. So we wanted to do something that would just reconnect everybody with the centre because hopefully it's not going to be too long before we get back here actually in the place. So we wanted to do something that would just sort of bridge the gap between us being closed and us being open. So what we thought we'd do is give a, a guided meditation so that you can be sort of like being here while you're meditating and you can play it whenever you want and do it for however long you want. So um, first of all, I thought maybe we should give you a little look around the shrine room because when we do open, we want to be very safe, we want to have a bit more space between us than we would usually have. So we've actually arranged the room and uh, we can show it to you. So, before we begin our session, I'd just like to say a few words about the best way to use this video so that you can meditate for as long as you want or as little as you want. So basically what will happen is that, as usual, as in all our sessions, we say the lineage prayer, and then I will give some guidance, a little bit of meditation guidance, and then I'll hit the gong, and then we will cut away to the shrine, there'll be a shot of the shrine, and then the, the Buddha's face, and then at that point if you want to pause the video there, so that way you've also got a beautiful visual reference as a support for your meditation if you wish. Either way, you just pause it there, and then when you've meditated for as long as you want, then you just press play and resume the video and in a few moments it will go to the lineage, the, uh, sorry not the lineage prayer, the dedication prayer which we say all together and finish the session wishing the best for all sentient beings and that's it, okay? So now you remember where we are, we're going to start our session as usual with the lineage prayer. It's very important to do this because it really connects us to all the great lineage masters of the Kagyu lineage and, uh, and then hopefully our meditation will be uh, touched by some of their, of their uh, mastery. Okay, so we'll do the lineage prayer.
just imagine any remaining tension leaving your body out through the soles of the feet. So the whole body is resting at ease while maintaining awareness of your posture. And just relax the mind. Let the mind rest at ease, here and now, letting go of whatever you did before, that's in the past, it's been and gone, you don't need to keep revisiting it. Or oh, not jumping ahead to plan the future. We just bring the mind home to be fully present in the present. Bringing it home to rest, but resting with awareness. Cultivating awareness. At ease, focusing, concentrating the focus from being busy with everything outward to bringing it in and sort of making the focus smaller, more concentrated, more aware, you could say more one-pointed, like a tiny dot of bright light. Focusing on that one-pointed bright light. And then imagine you're approaching this tiny dot of light, getting closer and closer. And then imagine actually entering into it. Entering that light, becoming one with it, it becomes then limitless. There's no difference between you and the light. It's infinite, luminous. And resting in that spacious, limitless, luminous light. You are the light. Let's finish our session by doing the dedication prayer and dedicating the merit of our practice, sharing the goodness, the virtue, whatever goodness has come from it, to share it with all sentient beings, especially at this time when people are suffering so much. It really helps if we can share the merit of our practice. And uh, hopefully we'll come out of this, this critical situation being kinder, wiser, and happier. Vesanam ditam chesekani, dropnei.